In this video, we will learn how to tune the ISQ MS. Open Excalibur and click Instrument Setup. Select ISQ. First confirm that the transfer line and ion source are at the correct temperature. Set the scan range from 10 to 100 and then right click. Choose Scan Now to start scanning. If the system is correctly tuned and without an air leak, the water peak intensity should not be greater than the 8th power of 10 after a few hours of pumping down. If the nitrogen peak intensity is greater than the 8th power of 10 and the water peak is smaller than the nitrogen, then check for a leak immediately. After confirming that there is no leak, close the scanning window. Set the mass range to 50 to 650 and select Scan Now. Choose EI in Calibration Gas to open Cal Gas. Normally, the 69, 100, 131, 219, 264, 414, and 502 characteristic mass peaks are displayed. Around mass 100, both sides should be relatively clean. If 69 base peak intensity is close to the previous tune, or all mass assignments are correct, or no source or filament maintenance is currently required, do not tune the system. If any of the above mentioned scenarios are not correct, you must tune or perform source maintenance. Tuning the system can vary depending on the application being used. Close the scan window and select Auto-Tune. There are two types, EI and CI. First we will demo EI Tune. EI Tune has four tune programs and a diagnostic. The Daily Tune Check is a quick system status check. If the system does not pass the Daily Tune Check, then run the Daily Tune. If the system cannot pass the daily tune, it is time to remove and clean the source. After cleaning and reinstalling the clean source, run an EI default tune first, followed by an EI full tune. The EI default tune resets all parameters to factory settings, and the EI full tune completely tunes all source components. Let us observe daily tune check. When tune is finished, the tune report will automatically be generated. The report will display the major characteristic ions. The characteristic and isotope peak shape need to be smooth and well defined. Compare the multiplier voltage to the last time the instrument was tuned. If the voltage increases dramatically, then perform source maintenance. The intensity of 69 needs to be greater than the 7th power of 10 or better. The leak check value should be below 6%. The report can be printed and is automatically saved. Next, let us demo CI Tune. First, confirm that the source and transfer line temperatures are set correctly. Select CI as the ionization mode and methane as the CI gas type. 
Enter the correct CI gas flow. And set the scan range from 10 to 100. Right click and select Scan Now for viewing the CI gas spectrum. The typical spectrum without Cal gas should be the protonated water at 19 peak is less than 50% of 17 and no visible 32 peak. Otherwise, there is an air leak. Also, 41 peak should be clearly visible. After checking the status, Close the window. Select Auto-Tune. In the Auto-Tune page, there are two options for CI Tune, positive or negative. We will demo positive CI. When the tune is finished, the report will be displayed automatically for review. First review that the peaks for 219, 414, and 652 are smooth and well defined. Compare the multiplier voltage to the last time the instrument was tuned. If the voltage increases dramatically, then perform source maintenance. The report is saved automatically 